Hey, hey, welcome back to another episode of the She's Making an Impact podcast. I'm your host, Rachel and Gome. Today we are doing some on-air coaching with one of our Activate students. I have Stephanie here with me today. How's it going, Stephanie? It's going good. Thank you. How about you? I'm awesome. Um, <laughs> you know, it's summer, so my son is here and he's like, I'm like, I'm going on a call. He's like, okay. Um <laughs> So that's, that's summer for you. Um, <laughs> he was at baseball camp all morning. So he's pooped. Oh, he's tired. Yeah. Yeah. Yesterday. Oh my gosh. He had baseball camp in the morning. Then he had a lesson. Then he had all-star baseball, like all afternoon. This kid, he has a goal. He's like, I want to be drafted when I'm 17. I'm like, okay, uh, let's go. <laughs> Anyways, this is about you. Um, so how I know we have about like 30 minutes or so together. So how can I best support you today? I think honestly, when I signed up for this coaching, um, it was around mindset Yeah, and getting into the modules has actually shifted that. So there's definite improvement and I'm thrilled. So the question is very different now. Um, Okay. And well, I do want to make like a comment about Activate because it has been so helpful and, and I thank you for what you put together. So, all right. So for the question. I'm, I'm able to start, I do um, grief support for Christian women, and I'm able to start some grief resources and events at the church, and I was thinking about a holiday one for the church, but then in our small group, because, you know, Michelle with the homeschooling is doing a summit, I was thinking, why not do a summit and then have that for both? Sure. Um, my only hesitation is, you know, an in-person event is kind of like, it's the holidays, you can do apple cider, you know, all that kind of thing. How do, do you feel like it can come across warm and welcoming, especially for people or women going through grief? That's the first question. Having an in-person or a summit? A summit. It can feel however you want it, like whatever your intention is going into it. So if you have the intention of like, hmm, I want to make this warm and welcoming, And then you brainstorm, how can I do that? What are some ways that I can make this interactive and warm and encourage these women? So, yeah, yeah, I mean, it's just about creating that intention going into it. Okay. And I had, you know, my list and I have a a private Facebook group and an email list and both of them are around 200 members right now. Is that large enough to do? a Yeah. Okay. So the goal of the (laughs) summit is actually to build your email list. So like Michelle, as she's um, going through her summit, she just added almost 900 people to her email list. Um, So that's the whole goal of it. It's to build your, it's to leverage other people's audiences to help you build your email list. Okay. Well, that's awesome. Yeah. Uh, And in doing it, how, how long do you need to kind of allow for the planning from beginning to launch? It depends on who you ask. Um, <laughs> realistically, realistically, I'm okay with messy action. I'm okay yeah. with it. <laughs> I would say like 60 to 90 days realistically. It depends on how good okay. you are with the tech. I'll okay. tell you though. Uh, so Sherry, she's um, she went through Activate and now she's in the Impact Partnership with me. Um, she did her first summit, took messy action and was like, I'm going to do it again. And she put it together for the second time in less than a month. And that wow. second time she did it, she added who she made over $20,000 wow. added, I think 5,000 people to her email list wow. with, Oh, I forget the numbers, but it was like, it was ridiculous with how many buyers she had out of it. Um, so yeah, she actually came to our activate event in January and she was like, I'm going to, I'm just going to do it again. And so she took messy action and then like, boom, um, went in and crushed it. So like the first time you do it, just know you're going to have like more pages to set up and more back end stuff and that kind of thing. So you want to give right. yourself a little, and just like getting the speakers, but yes. don't give yourself too much time. And in right. reality, like you can do it messy and get great results too. Okay. How many speakers would you would you suggest but i would ideally at least 10 um i think sherry had 20 to 30 
Okay. Um, so you can go like up to 30. Just it's one of those things of like the first time you do it isn't going to be the last time you do it. So right. you're going to like do it. You're going to test it. You're going to tweak it. You're going to make it better. The more speakers you have, the better chance you have of building your email list because you have right. more people that are emailing out their audience for it. But it's also like more headache because you have more like people that you have to corral. Manage. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like herding yeah. cats with, yeah. Yes. Yeah. And to that end, I was thinking initially that I would do the the actual speakers recorded and I would go live with, you know, kind of on a Zoom thing and then go to the from the video to the video for the first day and then actually have that for free and then sell it after that. What are you? <laughs> what are your There's so many different ways that you could do it. OK. Um, so like, we'll usually do it for free and then offer an all access pass and a VIP upgrade. And that will include the recording to the summit. But mm -hmm. something else that I do is I, um, and you don't have, there's like, there's so many different ways that you could do this. So I encourage you to like register for a bunch of different summits. So you could see all the different ways that people are doing it. Okay. Um, Cause we've had like one of our students, she did it um, over the course of a week and it was pre-recorded, but then she had like a live video um, part to it. I've done it in a three hour chunk of time where it's like, we get in, we get out, we're done. Um, yeah. I've had it where I ask each speaker to contribute an, a digital program to a bundle that we then sell. And then we donate the proceeds to charity. Okay. Um, so I mean, like, there's a million different ways you could do it. I would just test out different things to be like, Ooh, I loved it pre-recorded over the course of a week. And then you could try it live over the course of three hours and just be like, all right, which one do I like better? Um, okay. just test it out. Okay. All right. And I th really, that is like my, my biggest question right now is I'm getting excited kind of about a summit because then I can also offer to the church and everybody else and not kind of do double the, the work. Yeah. 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 That's great. Okay. Um, I would definitely have a VIP option where they get like the recording plus different bonuses. Maybe it's like it, like a, a call with you afterwards or something like that. Okay. And then oh, all yeah. those, all those buyers, I would offer okay. them a free, um, like a free strategy call or something like that, where all it's right. like a follow or a follow-up implementation call. And then you could see if they'd be a good fit for like a higher ticket offer after the summit. Okay. Now, do you, with the speakers, they're kind of affiliates. So they have the link to share. Yep. Um, do you allow them to offer their product or you just share the person and they share to their people and maybe people will go back to them later. Did that make sense? <laughs> okay. So when they're a part of the summit, what I, and we're very clear with this because we've okay. had people do promotion outside of what I wanted. And I was not so happy. And they okay. didn't tell me they were going to do that. Um, so I have them promote only what they're adding to the bundle. And okay. I'm very clear with them of like, our goal is to raise $10,000 for charity with this. And yeah. if we're sending people all over the place, it's going to divert the focus from us being able to raise this $10,000 for charity. Okay. And so if somebody connects with that person and they want to learn more, like they can always look them up on Instagram or look, right. look them up after, and they're going to be connected with them through the digital program that they're contributing to the bundle. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. All right. So we're you're making me think now about like contractual things. <laughs> so if you tag Candace inside the Facebook group, we have an okay. entire process street document. That's going to outline every single step of our summit, including our opt-in page. Thank you page sample contracts, um, okay. the emails to send beforehand, the emails that we send afterwards, our bundle, what was in the bundle, <laughs> like everything is in there. Um, these are little surprises that you didn't know this you were going to get awesome. when you joined Activate. So that's like a little extra bonus for you. This is a surprise. This is awesome. That's awesome. Yeah. Okay. yeah. You get it all. Thank you. Thank you very much. I got much. you. We just want to help you win. So I'm like, let's go. And you can tell because you really do like, I wish I had found you two years ago. I really Aww. do. Because it would have made life a whole lot less frustrating. And I have spent less money. I yeah. mean, it really, it's really both. <laughs> yes. Because you do lay it out and you share what's important and you get clear on your, I mean, all that good stuff. So thank you. Oh, well, thanks for being here. And I I'm love that you're just taking here. action. Yeah. That makes me so happy. <laughs> 
And that's all I had, girl. That's, that's it. it. That's awesome. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> so, well, you have homework. Your homework is to tag Candace, get the process okay. tree, and then just go in there and start taking action. And as mm-hmm. you're implementing, just share with us of like, hey, this okay. is my opt-in page. Can I get feedback on it? This awesome. is my VIP bundle. Can I get feedback on it? And that way we can just make sure that you're set up to win. Okay, great. Thank you. Awesome. All right. Well, I'm excited to see what you come up with and we're here (laughs) with you every step of the way. Thank you so much. Yeah. 